It's a beautiful part of the coastline. As soon as we take off, you can see all the way down the start of the Great Ocean Road, just over Torquay to Bells Beach, all the way down to the Twelve Apostles. I do feel pretty proud of the coastline that we have because it's instantly recognisable to anyone around the world. So to be able to fly along that every day, uh, you certainly don't get tired of the views, that's for sure. Hi, I'm James and I fly uh, vintage biplanes dating back to World War II up and down the Great Ocean Road. Tiger Moth's a family business that mum and dad started about 27 years ago. The aeroplanes that we're flying at the moment date back to around about 1941, 1942. They were used as training aeroplanes during the war to train pilots uh, to fly initially before they went off and flew sort of the fighter bomber type aeroplanes. This factory is completing its 1,000th plane for the Army. The Stearman Aircraft Company is the first to reach the 1,000 mark in the number of war planes delivered to the military forces. This particular aeroplane was built in 1941. It's a Boeing Stearman. There's only about 30 or so in Australia at the moment. All fabric, wooden construction. About half the people that we take off will do some form of aerobatics loops and rolls and spins and all that sort of cool stuff, getting up to around about 4G or so. It's a completely different experience wearing the leather jacket and the flying suit and the helmet and the goggles and, and having the wind rush through the wires and the engine chugging away up the front. It's pretty spectacular. This is a once in a lifetime experience for a lot of people and we have time and time again heard people say that it's the best thing they've ever done. So it's, it's pretty special to be able to uh, put that smile on people's face. Like I say, I don't get tired of it.